So this one's gonna be on how to be able to install basically any package within Jupyter Notebook. To be able to install anything, uh, any Python packages, just go ahead and type in, uh, usually if you do it on the terminal, it would be pip install, and then the name of the package. Or well, in Jupyter Notebook, it's basically the same thing. All you would do is you would type in the um, exclamation mark in front of pip, and then that's it. Then after that, you would just install whatever uh, you wanna install. So to prove it, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, open up the uh, IDE over here that I'm using, uh, PyCharm. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and, first of all, I'm gonna clear this up. So I'm gonna run pip list over here. Okay, and I'm gonna go ahead and delete something out of there. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and delete uh, Seaborn maybe. Let me see what I can delete. I'm gonna go ahead and delete Quando. So, do a pip uninstall. Quando. Okay, and that should go ahead and get rid of it. So, go ahead and click Y for yes, and that's it, it's gone. So now if I do again pip list, so this is within the environment, within the uh, PyCharm environment project. Okay, so it was um, Quando, so started with a Q. So as you see, it's gone, it's not there anymore. Okay, so now we're gonna go ahead and uh, go back to uh, Jupyter Notebook. And we're gonna go ahead and install it over here. So we're gonna go ahead and type in pip install and then Quando, like that, and then do shift enter. So it took a while for some reason, um, but it usually it doesn't take that long, maybe because I'm screen recording or something. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a pip list over here again. Okay, so let's see, pip uh, quando, we're looking for Q, so there it is, quando again. So as you see, it actually, once I installed it from Jupyter Notebook, it went ahead and installed it directly to the environment, so now I can even use it on my IDE. Okay, so that's how you're able to install any packages or libraries within Jupyter Notebook. So that's it for now. Bye.